ATP synthase is a molecular machine that works like a turbine. To convert the energy stored in the proton gradient into chemical energy stored in the bound energy of ATP. The flow of protons down the electrochemical gradient drives a rotor that lies in the membrane. Every proton flows to an entry open to one side of the membrane and bind to the rotor subunit. Only protonated subunit can then rotate into the membrane away from the aesthetic channel assembly. Once the protonated subunits are completed almost full circle and have returned to the aesthetic subunit, an exit channel allows them to leave to the other side of the membrane. In this way, the energy stored in the proton gradient is converted into mechanical rotation energy. The rotational energy is transmitted to the shaft attached to the rotor that penetrates deep into the center of the F1 ATPase, which catalyzes the formation of ATP. The F1 ATPase portion of the ATP synthase it has been crystallized. Its molecular structure shows that the position of the central shaft influences the conformation of the surrounded sevenate, and it is this changes that drives the synthase of ATP from ADP and PI. In this animated model, different conformational states are lined up as temporal sequence as they will occur during rotation of the central shaft. Like any enzyme, ATP synthase work in either direction. If the concentration of ATP is high and the proton gradient low, ATP synthase will run in reverse, hydrolyzing ATP and pumping protons across the membrane.